Yes, guys, welcome back to my video. Today, you're going to absolutely love it because it's the semi final. Actually, the semi final is tomorrow. And today, we're going to be preparing. I'm going to be showing you what I eat, what I do to recover. I had a training session yesterday, and also how I basically prime my body for the game tomorrow. So, you're going to see everything like that. Hope you enjoy the video. And if you haven't already, please like, subscribe. It helps out a lot. But yeah, let's get on with it. So we're going to start the day with a little bit of skipping. I like doing this day before game because it just gets your body moving, gets your muscles working a little bit, gets the blood flowing, and it's not detaxing the body. Good way to get so a bit of exercise in the day before a game. So that's what we're going to do. Guys, the rope has literally just bent in half and it's not, it's not, as soon as I move it out and start skipping again, it comes in half again. Bit of a problem, we're going to have to change our plans. And yeah, let's hope this new rope actually arrives quickly. So now we're actually going to head down to the gym, do a little bit of light movement, a bit on the treadmill, a bit on the bike, a bit of stretching. And also get in the pool, uh, do something similar to what I do actually for a warm up on a match day just to get my body primed, get my muscles moving, get my body ready really. Lunch now, just after swimming, gonna have some chicken, get some white rice. Hoped in for white rice because it releases the carbs quicker than brown rice. Better for a game. Let's get into it. <sighs> Boom, it's game day. <clears throat> it's an early kickoff to be fair, 10 30. So Usually with uh, games I'd have pretty much three hours before kickoff, but because it's ten thirty, I wanted to get that extra bit of sleep. So we're gonna have it at eight, eight o'clock. It's currently like ten to eight right now. So we're gonna get pretty much ready. Um, but yeah, I'm feeling pretty good. I had good sleep, feeling refreshed. So all the preparation really paid off. Yeah, let's get into pretty much. Guys, you've had an absolute mare. We don't actually have any chicken, so we're going to have to settle for some salmon. Isn't the best, but hopefully all the preparation we've done yesterday and everything that we've done will hopefully be alright. So yeah, it's what it is.
Yes, guys, so it's been a few days since that game, and I thought I'd just give you a little reflection, really. Um, as a team, we played all right. We definitely could have done better. Um, personally, obviously, it was my first game playing fully at right back in a competitive situation. I've done a bit of work in training, so um, I've sort of had a suspicion that I would play right back. So, obviously, preparing more for that, I knew I'd cover more distance. I actually covered loads of distance in that game, covered pretty much 10k, which is quite a lot more than I usually do. Um, but yeah, overall, I think I played quite well. Um, sadly, we did lose 2-0. But, I mean, we were in the game for a lot of it. Really competitive game against a really good side. So, yeah, we learned a lot from it. But I just want to say thank you so, so much for all the support. Just the shorts are blowing up. Getting loads of growth now on the YouTube channel. So, keep it up. Really, really happy with all of that. And soon, I'm thinking of starting a TikTok as well. So, go over to that and check it out. But yeah, guys, thanks for watching the video. I'll see you in the next one.